So hello, I'm here with the three with the, the best and worst moments of the season. We'll go over the best three games, the three worst games, the three best plays, and the three worst season moments. First, the three best games. Best game in my opinion. It's definitely at Pittsburgh. When Pittsburgh was ranked third in the nation. Jumping us to seventh in the nation. We played in Pittsburgh and manhandled them the entire game. Second best was beating Villanova, winning the NIT Bruce Pearl's first championship in any tournament. And uh, it was pretty awesome because Tennessee wasn't really talked about. And they go in here and beat the seventh team in the nation, Villanova, and they uh, end up winning. I know Villanova didn't turn out to be a great team, but it was a good win at that point. And the third is um, when Vandy came here earlier in the season and uh, we were down 17 and we cut it to 10 at halftime and ended up winning. Came from 17 down to win. Okay, three worst games. Number one, Charlotte. Charlotte University. In Charlotte. Okay, no one's ever heard of them, alright? And we lose by, to them by a point. We scored 48 in a game against Charlotte. Number two was the 30 point loss to Michigan. That one really bit. We were excited to get in the tournament, got a nine seed, all this stuff, and uh, then this stuff with Bruce Pearl comes out and we lose to Michigan by 30. And then finally was losing to Oakland. You go, you start out 7-0, and you go 7th in the nation, and then, and then you lose to Oakland. So, okay, now the three best plays. Best play of the year, Williams. Brian Williams put back against Georgia to win the game. While he was falling backwards, he throws up the shot off a put off a missed shot, and it goes in, and Tennessee wins 59-57. The second was the Scotty Hobson dunk. It was nominated for a lot of dunks of the year against South Carolina. He goes up one-handed and dunks it, and in midair, his knee is about where the South Carolina's guy head is. And third was the Brian Williams three against the Arkansas game. With the shot clock running down, they inbound it to Brian Williams, and he throws up a three, and it just swishes. And finally, to end on the three worst season moments, sorry guys. Uh, number one was losing to Florida three times. That that really hurt. That That's a, that's how many times Bruce Pearl lost them the entire seasons before this year, and then we lose to him three times. Number two was being seeded a uh, nine seed, playing Michigan in the Duke bracket. I wasn't very happy with the, the seedings at all. And the third was dropping from the top 25. We had been in the top 25 all of last year. We were about to break the school record for the longest consecutive weeks in the top 25. Seven and zero, ranked seventh, looks like it was gonna happen. And then we go on that bad streak and uh, just completely vanish from the radar. So there you have it, the best and worst of Tennessee basketball season, 2010 to 2011.